So what I don't like about this lens is there's two things that it, I didn't feel really good about it. First of all, the focus. It's kind of hard to find it, you know? It's not something like you just go there and the focus. I would say it's one of the hardest lenses I've ever had to, you know, to be right on focus. Even right now, if I'm trying to it, you know, it's a very thin, like, it's, it's, it's kind of hard. Let me tell you this, it's not a, a easy, easy focus lenses to find the right focus. So if you want to have something to be like, as I'm doing right now, moving back and forward, I wouldn't pick this lens. But how I'm using that for interviews, it's really good when you have people static right there, you know, so it's a really good lens for that. The second is how the lens receives the lighting, gets so much light in it that you do need to have a mate box or something to help you out with the lenses, okay? But overall, is it worth it to buy it? Definitely it is. This is probably the cheapest lens I've ever had. I wasn't, as I've said before, I wasn't considering to have that on my main backpack, but it ended up that I'm traveling with this lens every time, you know, I go anywhere. And I see you tomorrow here. I see you tomorrow.